welcome back to my channel today's video as you can see from the title it is going to be another hair review video this video is sponsored by love me hair so thank you love me for sponsoring this video if you want to see how i stock this beautiful beautiful undetectable lace front wig then just keep on watching okay so this is how your wig is going to come perfectly wrapped um this is 22 inches i believe um i believe it is a 13 by 4 lace front wig this one did come with adjustable elastic bands. It already came pre-bleached and with some baby hairs. And there's the elastic band that I'm removing. And then it came with two combs on the side, one comb in the middle and a comb in the back. And the curls are super cute. Literally, all you have to do is add water, which you'll see I'll do later on in the video. And I did go ahead and bleach the knots a little bit more as you can see this is their undetectable lace and they did bleach the knots but there were still a few knots that was still black and just for it to really just mimic my skin tone i just decided to go in and go ahead and bleach it again you don't need much bleach you want your bleach to be not thick but not loose either kind of like in between that i know people hate when people do these videos and they can't really explain that so just make sure it's not falling off of your spoon knife or applicator brush and using a very very light hand i go ahead and spread that onto the lace making sure not to press it into the lace because you don't want it to go onto the hair and bleach the hair you just want your knots to be bleached After washing out the bleach, I will go ahead and put the wig on my head. I always put the wig on my head to see how it fits, to see if I need to add the elastic band or adjust the back straps and see if I want to use the combs or if I don't want to use the combs. This wig did come already pre-plucked like I said but I did go ahead and pluck just a little bit more in the front and on the side since I did do a side part. If I would have did a middle part there's literally no plucking that needed to be done but since I did do a side part I did want to pluck just a little bit more to mimic the hairline a little bit more for me. And right here, I'm just zooming in to show you guys that this is definitely undetectable. Like, look how well it blends in with my skin tone. This lace, oh my goodness, girl, you need it. Their undetectable lace is literally a 10 out of 10. And I did go ahead and add in my elastic band, but for it to be really melted into my skin, I did go ahead and decide to use the Eva New York um, lace glue. I'm putting this in front of my actual hairline because I don't need my edges being ripped out, honey. So once I put the little dots, I go ahead and go in with a rat tail comb and then just spread that out evenly. And then you want to lay your lace once it gets clear or as clear as possible. To speed up the process, I did go ahead and go in with my blow dryer because, honey, I was in a time crunch right here. So I decided to use my blow dryer to get this dry a little bit faster. Mm -hmm. 
And like I said, you want it to be as clear as possible. This is this is really good enough for me. Um, then I'll just go ahead and lay the lace down because I am going to go ahead and wrap this with an elastic band. So you want it as clear as possible, but if it's still a little bit of white, it's okay because you're just going to wrap it and tie it down with an elastic band or a um, hair scarf. If you watched any other hair tutorials on my page, then you know never cut your lace with scissors. Always go in with a eyebrow razor. You want a more jagged cut for a more jagged hairline to make it look more realistic. And since I knew I was going to be wearing this wig to work, um, I do work 12 hour shifts overnight. So I decided to go ahead and go in with some got to be glue free spray to make sure this wig is definitely secured for my long 12 hour shift. I had already wet the wig when I washed out the bleach on the lace so I'm just going in with a little bit of foaming wrap lotion and putting that through the hair because since I've been raking my fingers through it and combing through it after plucking I wanted to define the curls a little bit more and literally that's all it takes. When I do side parts, I especially like to go in with a little bit of concealer to really define that side part to make it really, really nice. And as you can see, I got a little bit on the hair, but this is a little hack of how to fix that. I like to go in with mascara and just put the mascara over where I put too much concealer. You can also use this hack if you um, over bleach the knots on the hair. And if you get the hair blonde, you can just use that little hack and kind of just fill it in. But you can't get it So like I said, I am wearing this wig to work this same day of me recording this video. So I did want to ensure that the wig is laying as flat as possible. It was already laying pretty flat, but y'all know I love to go in with my hot comb to make sure it is all flat and looking really nice.
Okay, so you made it to the end. This is she, this is her. She is installed and really, really cute. So getting into the box, you do get your box. You may already have recorded this, but obviously you get your wig that's on my head. You get your little goodie bag. Inside your goodie bag is a edge brush. You also get a Love Me Hair, what is it called, like edge, lay down, wrap, something. And then if you guys watch my other Love Me videos, then you already should know what this is. This is one of their cute little mirrors. I absolutely love getting these because I do keep them in various purses of mine. So super cute when you need one on the go. And like always, of course you get your wig cap and then you get a brochure. So let's chat about the wig. I am wearing their undetectable lace water wave five. Well, no, I'm not wearing a closure. Okay, so I requested a undetectable five by five lace closure wig, but I think they mixed it up and they sent me a lace front wig. So I will have to get all the information about the wig down below. I do know it is their undetectable lace though, because baby, where's the lace? Where's the lace? Okay, please find it for me. Please and thank you. So yeah, really, really cute. I love, love me undetectable lace. You can't even tell where the lace is. So yeah, um, just guessing this may be a 13 by four lace front wig, undetectable lace, but yeah. Anyways, so I'm gonna email them and get all the information for this particular wig, like the dimensions for it. I do know it is their undetectable lace front wig, but I'm not sure exactly the link and everything because I think they mixed up. I was supposed to get a closure, but they sent me a frontal, but you know, nevertheless, it's okay. It's cool, maybe next time we'll do the closure and then we can talk about that, okay? But yes, I absolutely love this wig. Y'all know I love Love Me Hair. Love Me Hair is one of my definitely top three favorite hair companies of all time. It's super, super cute. The curl pattern is so cute. I literally just put water on it and then I also put in a little bit of that foaming wrap lotion, just a little bit in the front. The back I didn't even have to do anything to because the curls are so cute. So yeah, this is the hair. Don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe. And until my next video, I will see you at least then. Bye guys. Oh.